Hello ladies and queens. This is Chris, the Royal Queen of Bling, and I'm coming to you from my studio where I do my lives. And I'm being assisted today by my loyal assistant here, uh, Lady Jewel. Anyway, I've been dying to show you guys something that I learned and I learned this on, on just not too long ago. And I did show you one. I know a lot of you are a little nervous about buying large necklaces, long necklaces, because they're just a little too long. Well, how about if I show you how you can have those beautiful pieces and then bring them up? Now, this is one. I'm going to use this as the first one. I've already shown you about this one. And I'm going to turn Jewelrenti. I got her blinged up. Isn't that cool? Uh, how we did this again. Now, as you know, when I did that other video, I told you that you had, it had to be ones that had these big rings in it. Well, for this one that I'm about to show you, that's very true. But the next one I show you, you're gonna die. You're gonna love it. Anyway, so this is how this one worked. If you remember right, we take this big ring and we put the one side through and hang on to it. Then we take the other side and we put the uh, piece that has the extender through there. And then we take and hook them on the extender. So if my fingernails don't get in the way, I can grab a hold of this. And I'm going to put the last hook of the extender through there. And then you pull it like this and voila, you have a short necklace. Isn't that beautiful? So instead of having the long one, you can have a short one. As long as it has those loops in it, like this, you can do this very, very easily. Or you can wear it long. So you've got two necklaces in one here. Now here's the fun part. This is one of our brand new pieces and nobody has seen this on my live yet. You're gonna see it this coming Tuesday. But look at the size of this one. Whoa, that is awfully long. Now with this one, what I'm gonna show you how to do is to have this necklace shortened as well as have a necklace underneath. And once we finish with this, that necklace isn't gonna move. You know how a lot of times you'll take and twist a necklace or whatever, and you'll constantly be pulling at it to get it to go down back where you had it. With this technique, you're not gonna to have to do that. The only thing that you need to watch for is that the links are big enough so that you can put this hook through. That's all you gotta worry about. The ones that are kind of really, really, really tight, you're not gonna be able to do this with, but with this one, you can. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna unhook it, and again, we're gonna use Lady Jewel as our little experiment here. Put it around, and you wanna get it to the length that you want it. Let's say you wanna make it here. Before, it was way down there, remember? So we want it to be right about here. So what you're gonna do, the easiest way to do this and the most effective because you wanna have as much chain as you can is to kind of pull this off to the side so you can bring it up to where you want it, okay? So now what we're gonna do is we are going to take this and we are gonna hook it in the loop that is going to get us that length that we want. And I'm having trouble with my fingernails, ladies, so, and we want it right about there. So I'm gonna take this hook and I'm just gonna hook it right into that loop there. Okay, so we've got this long chain here, right? And as you can see, it's right where we want it. So we wanna get this and we are going to do this. We are going to bring it around her neck and we are gonna go back here, bring her around again, where we hook this in, we are going to unhook it and we are gonna put the last link to our extender through there like that. Then we're gonna pull it out and ta-da! Look what you have! You have got a shorter necklace and you also have another one sitting on top of it. And ladies, this isn't going anywhere. It's not going anywhere. You didn't have to use anything to do that. You just had to use the, you know, take the hook and bring it up there. Now you've got a shorter, and you can make this whatever length you want, make this longer, make this to match this. How easy peasy is that? So now don't be afraid of those long necklaces because now you have a way to get it shortened and also have a layered look. 
Hello? Paparazzi has it, ladies. So don't forget that when you see a necklace or a pendant that you really, really want, get it. You can make it into a shorter necklace. You can make it into a layered necklace. You can do anything with the paparazzi necklaces. Isn't that great? Thanks so much for watching. I hope this is a hint that you will use, and I'll be back with more tips for you in future videos. Take care now. Bye for now.